Okay, we're gonna take a little hike away from camp. Camp is down there in those trees. We decided we'd walk up here and take a look at this beautiful country that we have in front of us here. Ready? Back this direction is where camp is. And we're going to head back that direction here. Watching a storm roll in here. And I'm starting to hear it on the tent. We've got the fire going. Got Matt here in Asia. Starting to rain. Starting to rain. Gonna have to start putting things away. I thought I'd come out here and show you guys. It's 
cooled off about 10 degrees. And it's crowding up. And <clears throat> Looks like it's getting ready to cut loose. And that's looking to the south. All right, it's about four o'clock Sunday afternoon. We decided that it was probably cocktail hour. And so Matt jumped across the creek and filled our drink glasses with snow. Clean snow, look at that. All the way to the top. All the way to the top. So we're getting ready to have ourselves a nice strong adult beverage and relax here and enjoy the shade. have here is a 10,300 foot San Pedro punch slushy and uh, I suggest you probably not try this at home got to be in the right place to enjoy this it is uh, mid-June by the way it is it is June 12th and we are pulling snow and mixing it with our drink we have a fire going and yes, it's starting to rain. You can hear the thunder roaring. We're hoping it's gonna blow by us, but we're not so sure at the look of these clouds. Shoot. It's going to turn everything pretty and green though. It's amazing what a little bit of natural nitrogen does with the rain. Yes, that is thunder and it is lightning and it is hailing and raining. Fire is still going. Asia's in the tent. She's not a happy camper. As long as she can see me standing here, though, she's all right. Now the wind's coming up. It is stormy. But boy, it sure turns everything green real quick. Look at that. Okay, well we rode that first uh, rainstorm out and hailstorm. Still a little bit of thunder and lightning going on. Yeah. Looks like we might get a little bit more. Okay, I think about now I'm getting ready to cook with this thing. So we'll jump back a week ahead and kind of show you what it looked like before I started. Um, three beer cans. I'm going to cut cut these Budweiser cans off about an inch on the bottom. Put them together and I'll end up using this as a tray for it. It'll be an alcohol burning stove. This is a cool little thing I learned with uh, Matt and Rick when we were sitting around the campfire on, uh, on Easter night. Matt put one of these things together in about 15 minutes. So I thought that was cool. I'd love to try it. And uh, I'm going to put it together. I'll show you what it looks like when I'm done here. And then uh, you'll see what it looks like up in the mountains as well. Okay, here we are at Sunday night. Sitting around the campfire. The rain is gone. We got Matt sitting here relaxing too. I uh, Earlier in a video clip, you're going to see right before this, I'm going to show you what we ended up with. And I showed you the cans before we uh, cut them down. And these are the two uh, Budweiser cans that I showed you. And this is the bottom of the Foster's can that I showed you. 
and uh, we'll put alcohol in that and alcohol in this and this will be my stove and then uh, I use the outside of the Foster's can to use as a windbreak on the side so there is a little bit of a breeze and we'll use that to uh, keep the wind away from it so that's the deal and then I'll heat up my water for my uh, my delicious lasagna meal coming up okay so it's dinner time and I'm sitting here next to the fire and I'm gonna have uh, I'm gonna have me some lasagna that's having I've got uh, Louisiana red beans and rice with New Mexico chili mixed in there comes included with this pack so uh, thumbs up to that way to go back back a pantry how is it is it good delicious all right yep it's got a nice kick to it too well we'll ask you in the morning how it was yeah, all right yeah. <laughs> might be a little different in the morning yeah it might have a different opinion yeah for okay now, well for now it's delicious I'm gonna eat my lasagna and we're gonna see how it goes you take a little little peek in there not bad Okay. All right, here we are. The sun's going down. The rain is gone. Skies are clearing up. Looks like it's going to be a beautiful night. Going to be a cold one for sure. Okay, it's getting late. We're going to walk down here and Matt is going to get some snow for our final drink of the night. And he's going to disappear off into the woods there. sure where he's at but he's going in there into the, the woods in the meantime the sun's going down beautiful night in the wilderness it's gonna get cold tonight it is it'll be down into the 30s June 12th and in the 30s I love it okay I know it's dark but I want you to know that Matt the Southwest backpacker has risked life and limb to cross this major creek to get us uh, uh, some snow for our final drink of the night. Final drink of the night, icy you, cold drink. You are a hero by any person's standards. I we still got to make it across the creek. All right. The things I it is done. Let's get a close up look at that. All right. Snow. Yep, we're gonna have frost All right. on the outside of these just like we did last time. Alright, good job. Thumbs up. Thumbs up.